Hello everybody and welcome to the highly anticipated episode 2 of Secret of the Magic Crystal. For those of you who are unaware, I played this game last year and it was an absolute hit. We're going to be converting the entire channel into a Secret of the Magic Crystal channel. This is a game where you raise, look after and race mythical horses. So we're going to get right into it. Let's go and have a look at our stable. Have a look at some of our horses that we've got here. Look at these beautiful, beautiful steeds. Our absolutely glorious, glorious fella here. Big Wang Horse. <laughs> I completely forgotten I'd called him that. But let's have a look. What can we do? Can we, can we, can we groom? How about you have some water? There you go. There you go. And uh, how, how about some grain? Would you like some grain? Got some crazy good speed on this boy. He's in a hundred percent of condition and spirit. I mean, those glasses—they—they they must be doing a lot. Let's let's take this and give him a little little scrub. He does not like that. He does not like that. Let's give him a scrub down. There you go, little fella. There you go. Clean you right up. There you go, majestic beast. And a small brush too for your neck. He doesn't seem to like that. I'm sorry, fella. I'm sorry. Right. What's in the shop? Let's have a look. Let's customize. Now, I think, honestly, our horse is looking pretty good. So, we don't need to worry too much. We, we actually have a lot to unlock. Do I dare <laughs> go to the store? Okay, that is, um, that is an online store where I have to pay real money. Um, I don't know if we're going to do that today. Uh, let's, let's head back. We can buy new troughs, new feeders. Oh my god, we've absolutely customized this place. It's looking beautiful. We'll switch over to the steel lamp. Oh, it's 88 gold. I'm, I'm willing to. For my horse, I'm willing to. Right. Is there anything else we can maybe maybe do for you here? Uh, legs? We got some flowers going on? Yeah, let's get those on. Let's equip those down. Then those bad boys. We haven't locked any other hats yet. Damn, I'm looking. I'm looking for that three feather or a pom pom. That that'd look really, really nice. But let's let's go back. Let's uh, head out. Let's go towards the blacksmith. See what we can do in here. Might be some good stuff we can get going on in the blacksmith. Okay, the horse is coming with us. That's good. That's good. Right. Can we make make some new hoofs? Maybe. Um. Oh, we've got some crystals. Some. Adamantus and some some herbs of some kind on our um. I, I, I'm not sure. <laughs> Here's our recipe book. Let's have a little look-see. This recipe was hidden in a hollow of a big old tree in the middle of the forest. We can buy some new ones. Um, some new horseshoes. Lots and lots of horseshoe recipes. We can't follow this one. We don't have enough gold for a horseshoe recipe. We spent a lot of our money on, um, on a lantern, so that's unfortunate. Let's see about this, though. So... Can we... Do we have the ingredients? Take a look at this. Okay. So we've collected those ingredients. You have made a bad combination. Um... I'm unsure as to how. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? But, as I said, guys, this channel is going full Secret of the Magic Crystal. Every game we play now is going to be horse-related from now on. So, we do have to... To get the uh, sort of learn the ropes of this whole thing. Forest course. This sort of training develops the stamina and dexterity and the speed of your horse. Let's do it. Let's get some training going, shall we? I mean, we definitely need to make sure to train up. Let's go. Get ready. Right. Can I remember any of this? Up. <laughs> oh. Um. I think we did something. Oh, yes. We're getting the hang of it. We're getting the hang of it. Back. Oh. Oh, my God. We're getting it going. We're actually doing it. Get another gallop going there. Big Wang's got this. Big Wang's got this. Boom. And we hit another jump. What an amazing trick. What a great run this is. This is actually a roguelike. This is all procedurally generated. The items and sticks we find along the way will all be random. This is the new hottest roguelike you've ever seen. Oh, no. Oh no, Big Wang, press the wrong button. What are you doing there, fella? <laughs> oh, we can make it over that stick. Yes, there you go. And here comes another one. Ooh, a very unexpected up. <gasps> Wasn't really expecting that. And oh, a back and up. Complex stuff's going on here. But we're getting it. We're getting the hang of it. We're raising our speeds. 
Our, our horse's stats, raising its speed, getting it ready for the big race. Oop, we've jumped over that one too. Oh, nice. So good. I'm liking the little reef we've got going on in our buttocks as well, and the, some sort of flower that's at the base of the tail. Hey, we finished. Does that raise our skill at all? Perfect. 86%. Very nice indeed. Very nice indeed. Um, now we've got... We've got this one here. Let's go through all these training exercises. Dressage. Um, speed and dynamic reflexes. We need to get those trained up. We have to. We, we just... What are we going to do with our speed and dynamic reflexes? you got to have them. Get ready. Let's go. Let's go. Dressage. It's time. Should we just discuss a little bit about why dressage even exists in real life? Oh my god, look at it. Majestic. I mean, you can really see how the, um, the little flowers that we've got on our... Uh, on our horse hoofs here is just really making this all go so much better. Good. Oh my god. Good. Oh, I want more perfects. I have to wait a little longer. Let's try and get a perfect here. Good? No. I want a perfect. Give me a perfect. Perfect. Yes. We've got to wait a little second. It's hard to perfect this. Oh, you can actually see a line in the terrain there. That's nice. Finish, we didn't do so good on that one. Nowhere near as good as last time, but we've still got 83%. That's still pretty damn good. And let's go for the last one. We've got some um, some obstacle course to go on for our strength and reflexes. Oh, my horse is exhausted. I do apologize, horsey. Let's go to the barn. Maybe we'll get you some food. There you go. We can, we can make it some Persians, apparently. Um, eat from this. I think you should eat from this. What light going up here? We've got a stethoscope to make sure our horse is okay. Are you all right? How are you doing? Your horse is healthy. Good. We've got a pestle and mortar. Let's just whack all those in there and make some drugs. Oh my god. I was not expecting QTEs right now. <laughs> oh no, I missed one. Oh no, I missed another. Oh no, I missed another. My timing's gone. Oh, no, that wasn't very good, was it? Only 62%. Let's get another one going, shall we? You have made a successful combination. Nice. Drink it, horse. Drink it. Um, so, where do we put this now? Do we put this in here? In here? I don't understand. Just drink it. Oh, my God, she drank it all. You thirsty bitch. Right. Let's have a look in our book. What have we, what have we made? We can get some recipes going again. Um... Should we seek for a new recipe? Oh, we, we probably should seek for a new recipe. There's some expensive boys in here. Let's go Let's go top dollar. Go for all these. Um, nice. So now, can we can we use pestle and mortar and get another one? Not enough ingredients. Sad times. Can we go and pick some ingredients, maybe? Let's go to the gate. Actually, can we go to just the farm? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold up, horsey. Hold up, horsey. Can we just go to the farm and see what's there? Or is this just an, is this just an overview? We're learning. Okay, this is just an overview. We can go to this thing here. Um, upgrade. Unfortunately, I have the money to upgrade. Ah, oh, we really should be saving up for some upgrades. Let's have a look. See. Oh yes, breeding. Yes. <laughs> we are one star. Um, and let's see. Can we? Should we go to the gate? We've got a bell icon here. Let's see if we can upgrade this. Three hundred gold. That's insane. What's What's these shamrocks? What was that about? I'm I'm unqualified for this horse training. I don't know what's going on. Right. Let's uh let's have a look in here. Um the Arena Cup competition of the fastest horse. Let's go. Let's do this. We are in competition. Big Wang is ready to go. He's ready. Now, can I can I remember how to steer this down? Okay, the horse is just gone. And it just says 30 seconds left. Ah, we don't get to play this. We just have to wait. That's nice. <laughs> so we'll wait for this and uh, see what happens. I don't know what these bars at the bottom mean either. Um, apparently it's a unicorn. 98 intelligence though. I mean, 124 reflex out of 100. 134 stamina out of 100. This horse is doing well. Okay, you're back, are you? You're done? I won a cup. Great stuff. 50 gold. 
All I had to do was nothing. Right, let's have a look here. Oh, multiplayer. Please, please tell me there's some players online. Let's have a look, see, shall we? By the way, I bought this as DLC. The game does not come with racing by default. I bought this. I am committed to this series. Right. Crystal Mountain. Let's have a look. Waiting for players. It unfortunately looks like we're not getting many players at all here. Sad times. We're going to have to have a long way here. Let's look through some of these. Let's have a look what these do. So we've got maneuvering. To keep things simple, you uh, only need to see your course by using the arrow keys. Acceleration and braking are done automatically. Wow. Just lovely. You can press control to use power-ups. Oh, very nice. Very, very nice indeed. Um... We've got Magic Crystal, slow down all of your opponents, Burning Horseshoe, helps you turn the roughest road without losing speed, protects your horse from any harmful effects, allows you to drop obstacles behind you, gives your horse a serious amount of extra speed for a few seconds, cures your horse and removes any unhealthy effects, and speed jumps. You'll encounter obstacles with rainbows showing the way to them. Try to get rainbow for extra speed. Okay, we're ready to go. Look at these majestic boys. I mean, I have to say, our horse isn't exactly looking the best. Oh my god, we're, we're, we're in it, we're in it. Okay. Okay, this is this is, this is some difficult stuff. We've got to remember, there's no accelerating here. We've just got to <laughs> be on, on it with the turns. We can look at the map up there, but this is... I don't know why people have been playing Mario Kart. Like, what have you been doing? Let's use this herb. We're, we're way in the back right now, way in the back. Oh no. I hit some water. I didn't... Oh, there you go. We can get a little bit extra speed here. Oh my god, I'm way in the back. We need a speed boost. That is a massive speed boost. Oh my god. Oh yes, we just got a bit of a speed boost from that as well. Nice. Oh my god, those those water pails. That's some difficult stuff right there. But luckily, we're in, we're in front. We're in front. We've, we've, we've made it into the lead. Let's go for the speed boost there, because these are incredible. The speed boosts are just insane. Let's drop some water pails. I can't believe it drops three. Mario Kart ain't got nothing on this game. My god. We're, we're in it though. We're, we're going. We're going. This level seems good. Oh no. I missed the speed boost. That could be detrimental. We could lose a space here. Let's make sure to drop our water pails. Get something going on. Make our way around. We've, we've, we've rounded out the first, first lap. We're still in the lead by a decent margin here. We can keep this lead. We can keep going. Again, this is definitely a roguelike, completely procedurally generated tracks, never the same, all the power-ups change each time, we can get semi-permanent progression, there's no meta currency in this game, it's so to say, but we'll see if we can find something, oh my god, there's water pails in the track and we got hit by some sort of ice bomb, <gasps> they're catching us, they're catching us, right, let's take, let's take this boost again, this boost was instrumental in our lead last time, so let's make sure we get that. We, it seems like it's got some Mario-esque um, things in it where if we're in the lead, we get worse power-ups. Makes sense. Hopefully no one gets that crystal one again because that guy is on our tail. We've got to keep moving, keep going even fast. I don't know what that guy did to get all the way over there with those water pails, but that is not the way to play this game. We're rounding this corner. We've got to remember that last time there was a speed boost over just round this corner here. Hopefully we'll be able to get it this time. We need to turn the corner a little tighter and make sure we get it. Yes, we got it, we got it, and that is a big, big help in this coming into the final lap here. I think we've just about got this race under wraps. We've got a nice lead. There's one person just behind us. Don't know which one it is, but I think we're going to be just okay here. Let's keep going. Mass Wang, let's keep going. Huge Wang, whatever your name is. I cannot remember my stupid horse's name, but aren't we looking fabulous? Hopefully, we'll get a decent amount of money for this race. Coming to the second one, looking a little more fabulous than before. This is a difficult place to have a bunch of water buckets, but that should slow down the opponents quite nicely. It's around the corner. Oh, making a sharp turn into the next boost. We've got the next boost. Yes, here we go. Rounded the corner again. Here we go into the power-ups. Let's see if we get some more water buckets. And we get some more water buckets. I do not know what that is, but I do not want it because it seems like it could be a trap. Oh no, and that corner's been a little bit too wide. We may have lost our first place here. It depends on if the person behind us hit the water bucket too, but I think they did. I think we're okay. I think we're rounding the corner. Get the next boost, and I think this should secure our position in first place. Very, very nice. We're rounding the last few corners to first place. Now we might be able to just about hit that boost again around this corner if we can make it sharp enough. We've got to turn up really sharp here. 
get that boost there you go and that just about secures our position in first place I think I think uh, massive wang huge wang whatever his name is is going to be coming out in the clutch with the first place finish let's just see just about how much gold we get for that very very nice 50 whole schmeckles for that 50 whole schmeckles absolutely beautiful what a great race we have four whole tracks to go for here let's go for the octa road maybe this is rainbow road maybe this is this game's version of rainbow road it's going to be so much better than rainbow road ever could be though so unfortunately we are waiting yet again for some players it seems that um this game surprisingly enough doesn't have a very big online community but if everyone, if everyone buys this game and gets on board, we could have this community absolutely booming. Could be racing and having a good old time all year round. Because as I said, Enter the Gungeon is cancelled. We're going to be playing this game exclusively from now on. This is, this is no longer, Enter the Gungeon is no longer my favourite game. Secret of the Magic Crystal is where it's at. I mean... We, we, we can see so far just the plethora of content that we've got to play with. I mean, we definitely need to be upgrading our stables and seeing if we can get some uh, some better horses. But for right now, I think, honestly, our horse is doing pretty well. We've been... Well, we're two for two in wins last year when I played this game. We won our first race and we just won another. And let's get on to our last race of the day. Look at that strawberry that guy's got on his back. Oh, no. Well, a little sad face. That's actually kind of cool. I want that. Oh my god, we're moving through, passing by. Okay, we, we did have a bad start last time, so we've got to be prepared for that. Um, unfortunately, we didn't get a power up there. We probably should have gone for that boost instead. But yes, uh, we are going to have to play this a little cautiously. We don't know this circuit. And as I said, completely procedurally generated. Definitely a roguelike of, it, of, of the first of its kind, actually. It's so, it's so much like not a roguelike, but it is, that no one can even know. And we got in front very easily there. This is a tight course. we got to remember that planting the buckets does hurt us as much as it hurts our enemies. So we got to really be cautious about that. I'm going to save these buckets until we maybe get to a little bit of a tighter corner here. Like here, that is a perfect placement there. That is kind of evil. And I actually heard a few opponents in the background there take a few hits. I don't know what that little potted plant thing was there. Was it maybe some extra gold? Extra schmeckles? Or I'm not sure. Either way, let's make sure we get this boost this time. This boosts, these boosts are like instrumental in just overtaking and staying ahead because they give you so much speed. My god. And as you can see, some of our water buckets are still there. Um, we've got to be really careful about that. One of the people just behind us did actually hit one of those just then. And people have planted yet more of these around the course. Going to get a few more here because that is a very, very tricky position for anyone to dodge any of those in. So, gives us a nice leeway there. And put that on the apex of the corner. People can't really take that corner as quick as we can. Unfortunately, oh, that turn was a bit wide. We lost quite a lot of speed there. I'm going to try and pick this up this time. Oh, I missed it. I do not know what it does, but I missed it again. Right, let's keep going through. We are on to lap three of three. I think we've just about got this one in the bag. Now, that's a tricky bucket there. That is a tricky bucket, but we'll place a few of our own right there. And we can actually hear the people taking it in the back. And honestly, there's a guy right close to us. We need to be very, very careful here. We've got someone right on our tail. I didn't realize we had someone quite so close. Now, we've got to be careful we don't hit that water bucket, thank God. We did line that one up nicely. And actually, as you can see... The person that was right behind us seems to have fallen trapped to uh, a few of the buckets that we placed along that route. Maybe more than one because he fell very, very far behind and seemed to uh, unfortunately take a bit of a loss there. Still don't know what that thing does because I keep missing it. But that is going to close out the race. Absolutely beautiful. So many people call computer on this game. My god. We've earned ourselves a nice 100 gold. Let's head back to the stable, shall we? And see what we can do with the schmeckles. Right, we're on 160 now. Can we maybe, maybe afford to um, upgrade something here? Let's have a look. Upgrade. We can upgrade the well for 100. Upgrading your well will enable you to have another horse in your cell. Oh my god, yes. Second horse. There's some shamrocks there again. Really don't know, don't know what's going on with that. Oh, that gave us 100 gold. Um, there's more there. Okay, you have to be very quick to click those. But we could technically just sit here and wait for the shamrocks to show up. And click them and get a ton of gold. Alright, it started to rain. Maybe that's something that only happens in the sun. 
I'm not sure, but we just got a hecking lot of gold. Hecking lot of gold. Good, good, good. Um, maybe we can upgrade something else. I'm, I'm assuming these are going to be quite expensive. In, in fact, if we could wait for one more shamrock to show up, we could quite easily afford this. And it, by the looks of it, this weather has a shamrock in store for us. So. A little four-leaf clover. Let's see if we can get it. Come on, there's a rainbow. I mean, there's got to be one now, hasn't there? There's an actual rainbow. Keep your eyes peeled, people. Keep your eyes peeled. This is riveting gameplay. Absolutely riveting. I am... I am so very entertained. Where on earth? Come on. By the way, the music's kind of banging. Okay, the weather doesn't really last very long in this. It kind of changes pretty rapidly. Doesn't look like we're getting another shamrock, unfortunately. Another four-leaf clover. Um, is there anywhere we can upgrade? 300. 300. 300. Oh, my God. Everything's so costly. Um, let's enter. I think, unfortunately, we're going to be leaving there. But look, we've won a cup. And I think that's going to be a good stopping point for this episode of this brilliant game. I'm, I hope you're all looking forward to a whole year, if not forever, of this game. Because it's just so good. And any other horse-related content. because And mythical horse-related content. I mean, you guys know it. You're going to love it. Either way, I hope you guys have enjoyed this nice April Fool's episode. I did this exact game last year. Um, and... I actually had multiple requests to bring this back this year, and so I did. Very fun game. <laughs> I don't know, I, this game is so strange. I don't even know why I have it in my Steam library. I just, last year, just looking around for a game to play for April's Fools, and it was there. And then this year, I was like, okay, I have to play it again. The sequel, and we'll just keep this going each year. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And yeah, happy April's Fools. I'll see you guys in the next one.